Coming to you live from Dell EMC World here in Austin, Texas. I am here with David Hardy. David, how are you? I'm great. How are you doing, Mark? I'm doing well. So you're in our Extreme Scale Infrastructure Group. Yes. Quick, what, is, what does that mean? Extreme Scale Infrastructure Group is a combination of our classic DCS, full custom server and modular data center development, and DCS, which is a little bit of power edge with tailoring for a different set of customers. That's and so, combined as that's ESI. Got it. And so what do you do in this group? I'm a product marketing manager. I focus on the modular infrastructure piece. What we've got here is a new version of our modular infrastructure, which is what we're calling the micro MDC. So traditionally we've done capacities ranging from 400 kilowatts to a megawatt. We're getting a lot of interest now from customers who are looking for smaller footprints from the single up through the four or five rack capacity. This is a three rack version where you can have a fully independently supported edge compute stand, popular with telcos, content distributors, things of that nature. And we're debuting it here today at Dell EMC World. Awesome. So as you said, we've been doing the big MDCs in the past modular right. data centers. Who have been some of those customers? Well, because modular data centers are providing uh, power distribution and cooling right size to a certain workload in a real fast and efficient manner, the cloud providers have really gravitated towards these because they speed uh, time to operation for all of their circuit deployments. When we get to the smaller footprint, you're going not just to the cloud providers, but uh, that full range makes it appropriate for customers who are doing uh, cloud native app development, uh, having applications that are take advantage of being smaller footprints closer to different communities, uh, shorter latency requirements, providing a better user experience for uh, the, the user base in a certain community as opposed to a, a national sort of distribution. So, and then just to double click on cloud native apps, uh, you all in this group are not uh, not a Johnny come lately to this group. Uh, how long have you been uh, dealing with customers who are who are deploying and building cloud native apps? We've been doing server development and modular data center development, as well as the integration of those two things into a complete solution since 2008. So, quite a while. We've had almost. Three 300 modular projects executed, and that's standing up about 125 megawatts of IT workload. So uh, it's hard to get a lot of really accurate statistics in the industry for, for modular infrastructure, but we believe we're the leader, if not among the top in the, in the world as far as this development is. Cool. And as you said, these are running uh, cloud-native applications uh, that, are, that are then being deployed on this. So what is next for, uh, let's really say, MDC, mini, da mini Modular Data Center? And of course, I just coined that. That's not the real name. <laughs> yeah, so, well, the Micro Modular Data Center, and don't worry, I'll write that down for you, Martin, is really still a demonstration of capabilities. As I mentioned, we've got customers who are looking for as small as a single rack support that can be outside of a data center. Uh, Say you've got a, a central office where it's, it's it's already full. You need something outside, you, or you have a cell tower that you run a certain amount of compute capacity in a region. We do these that will support a single rack all the way up through, as I said, over 20 racks in a in a solution. Conceptually, it's all the same though. It's looking at a customer's workload, right-sizing the amount of IT. Maybe it's a half rack of DSS 9000, like we've got integrated here. Maybe it's a couple of racks. But then we scope the power requirements and the cooling requirements so that you've got a complete system deployed, able to be run as a, as a lights out data center that can be then monitored remotely on a single pane of glass. So it's really trying to provide end-to-end -end solution for our teleco customers. Awesome. David Hardy, right. thank you so much. Thanks, Mark.